Good morning, children. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, wiping the sleepy eyes out still. Good morning. You guys excited to get baby back today? Yay. Yeah. He's gonna be a cone head. <laughs> I'm so anxious. I just want her back. Thank you. Good morning, guys. It's uh, it's Wednesday and 8 a.m. on the dot. We got a phone call from the vet to say the baby's doing well and that she's ready to be picked up. So, big sigh of relief for her. She actually had that kind of like, what if they call and they say she had a rough night or you know she's not ready to go, they need to keep her another night. I didn't think about that. I just think like, oh yeah, she'll be fine. Like, you know, one night in there with fluids and stuff. Um, she did eat something this morning. They did give her one of her medicines, but I guess they couldn't give her the second one. I don't know what that means. We'll find out when we get there. Uh, we'll also find out about, you know, whatever details we need to know about for caring for her. We've done this before. We know we have to blend her food. She's been drink, uh, eating a liquid diet for a while. Um, and then I, I said, I'm mo more eager to find out what she actually ate. That's what I'm like. I wonder what was in her stomach. So, why don't we pick up baby now? Hi there. Hi. <laughs> hi. 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 Is this uh, your hi. guys' mobile? Yes. Hi. Oh. Um, she's got that wrap there on her leg from where her catheter was, so you guys can hi. get it on the bottom of the Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are good to go. Thank you. Hi. Hi. There's the dog we remember. There's the dog we remember. Oh my goodness. Hi there. Hi there. She's like, let's go. Let's go home. I want to go home. Get me out of this place. She's panting. She's bobbing, weaving. She's growling at me when I try to pet her. That's the dog I remember now. Hmm. Getting back to normal now. Stinky. <laughs> She's so stinky. And you were just saying you're gonna give her a bath, huh? Right before this all happened. <laughs> and I can't. <laughs> Alright, she's back. She already went outside and went pee. She's trying to drink some water. That cone though, man. That cone is going to be more annoying than anything. <laughs> she's knocking her water bowl over. She's banging into everything. Huh. Yeah. But you're already, you're already getting back to normal. I love it. This, this is our doggy. Yeah. So we did confirm it was the Nerf ball. The, the surgeon thought it was plastic. It's not. It's... I think mean, she looked at it and thought it was a golf ball, but that is definitely the Nerf ball. So that confirmed is what caused the blockage. And it does look like, like, it, like it swelled up. It does look, look a little bigger than normal. So maybe when the stomach acid got to it, it started to expand. All right, so uh, next steps at this point is just uh, care. Um, she got, like I said, three medicines to take. We bought some uh, some wet food to give her to just make it a little easier on her, on her uh, insides as far as eating and digesting. Um, the most difficult part is going to be that cone. That cone is just going to be a pain in the butt. Tiffany reminded me last time, five years ago, we went and bought a different cone. It was a little bit smaller, a little bit... Not so sharp on the edges. Yeah, because that thing just catches everything. Um, so we might do the same thing. We might go buy a different um, cone just because she has to have it on there for almost two weeks. They said about 10 days. But as I said in yesterday's vlog, this can't happen again. The, the surgeon basically straight up said her insides are pretty messed up with all the scar tissue from the first surgery. Um, she was a little like, she wasn't sure if this was going to be a successful procedure because of where the, the ball was lodged and located. It was around scar tissue. She's like, I don't think she's going to survive a third one. So we already talked to the kids last night and basically we just have to be very, very diligent about her surroundings when and when, when we're not here, both. I and mean, even when we're here, we have to be diligent about it because she just can't swallow anything. And if we have any suspicions that she did, we just gotta make her throw up, like every time. Even if she, I think we've done that before. I think we made her throw up before and nothing came up. We're like, oh, she didn't yeah. eat anything, you know. We ended up finding it. it was a bouncy ball. We ended yeah. up finding it. We swore that she. We ate swore it. she ate it, and then we made her throw up, and she didn't throw anything up. And then, like, oh, a day later, we're like, oh, look, there's the bouncy ball. Sorry, baby. But at this point, it's worth it. Yeah. So her surge, her her uh, scar is a lot smaller. It's a lot smaller incision than last time. Like last time, it was like her whole belly. This one's small. So we're not we're not sure if she's gonna be able to get up on her on her normal bed, so we made her another bed. But she's not a big fan of those. She only sits in them for like a minute and then she gets up and leaves. She just likes to lay down like that. That's her spot. All right, I'm gonna try and give her some of her medicine here so she can eat. Seems like a lot. Not it's not water. completely all dissolved. That's not five milliliters of water either. 
will absorb some of the water. <laughs> I need a little bit in you. It's okay. Good girl. Hey, good girl. Good girl. It's all in the tone of the voice. Yeah. Hey. Open. Hey. Hey, open. No. Hey, look at me. Look at me. Hey. 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 Shh, shh, shh. It's okay. It's okay. Open. 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 Hey. Don't you bite me, please. Hey, open. There you go. Hey, good, good girl. girl. Good girl. It's okay. Yeah. yeah. One more. One it's more. not horrible. Shh, it's okay. Good girl. Here we go. Ready? There you go. Good, good girl. girl. Good girl. Yeah. Take like yeah. half of it. <laughs> Ready? Here we go. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. That a girl. Okay, I feel I better. I just slaved in the kitchen all day to make her first meal. That looks like something you'd make. I know. Look at the rice. Carrots, like green food. beans, and chunks of oh, meat. Meat. Mmm, baby. You need to eat good. She's definitely hungry. These are good babies. So, baby, just can't get comfortable enough to lay down and sleep, huh? See, this stupid cone is in my way, and my belly hurts. Yeah? Do you agree? Am I talking for you? Mm-hmm. 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 Somebody's home. Watch TV. <gasps> Who's here? Oh. Who's here? Baby. Oh. Looks funny, but cute at the Oh. I can't pet your head. You can kind of get behind your ears. <laughs> She's excited to see you. What? Is she acting different? Yeah. As soon as we saw her at the vet, like she was like, I don't say back to normal, but like totally back to baby. Like, like right now, she's wagging her tail, she's happy to see you. Happy to see you, yeah. She's just a little annoyed and frustrated with that thing around her head. Somebody help me take this thing off. We ordered a new one. We'll be here later. Why did you order a new one? Something a little more comfortable for her. Small. <laughs> yeah, remember we first had a clear one and then we gave her like a green one. All right, so we just pulled up photos of her first surgery. Yeah, this was this was five years ago, and that's all the way across her belly. Because like, they had to get a whole sock out. Well, no, it's because oh her intestines were all messed up. They oh, had to so fix her intestines, so they that's probably right. went wider. Oops. In this yeah. instance, yeah, they shaved like all the way yeah. up to her. See this front paws. this time it's just down here, and her incisions like Bryce's. It's just one tiny like maybe inch, inch and a half. Things. Oh, she was tiny. So she's a tiny <laughs> little girl. That big old cone head. See that? It's like almost the same size. I remember they shaved her butt and her um, yeah. ankle. Was yeah. that? Why did they do was that? that when they did the the pouch? Pouch. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. She pouch. doesn't have that this time. Fluids. Do you want to show off your scar this time, babies? Will you let me? I tried to. Look yes good. or no. Here, let's just see, okay? She still has that on, we gotta take that off. Oh, you can tell of her roly polies. Yeah, you can't really see it. She's got a roll hanging down. Oh, there we go. That's better, thank you, baby. Yeah, She's helping you guys out. But there's no stitches, like I said. Oh. She's laying down times. Oh yeah, you can see her scar from last time. Yeah, when I shaved her, you can yeah. see Yeah, if you guys can see that, you can see the scar going all the way up. And then, obviously, the bright red. Is the fresh incision. Who's here? Go see. Go see. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Who's that? Who is it? Babies! <laughs> Right. Doing better? I know I look a little silly. You look um, ridiculous. <laughs> I ordered a blue one for her You look ridiculous. Which one comes from? Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. <gasps> She's a little different, huh? She's actually me. acting more herself. Yeah. You're so happy you're better now. Oh, oh, she's gonna like try to lay down and give you the... She's having a hard time laying down. Oh! oh look at that! It's not as thick. 
Yeah. No, no, That's not. better. Aww. That's good. Yeah. That's the first time she's done that. She's right here. Stay there and lay down. Okay, it's a little bit bigger than what I thought. It's like half of it's what half it was. It's the size, yeah. Oh my goodness, but you can see her scar from yeah. last time. Yeah. No. Baby, so my goodness. You're so happy. I'm just so tired. You're very tired. Do a little homework while mom braids your hair for volleyball. Bryce is eating some leftovers, watching some Fortnite. Yo, I put up my November uh, stream highlights, you know, if you want to check that out. There's some Fortnite in there. Not sure if we mentioned, Sierra has an extra day of volleyball today. Coach picked up a scrimmage against the 14s. Regional. Regional team, so he always likes Destroy. to squeeze in extra time, touch of the ball, touch on the ball, anytime he can, so. And this girl doesn't mind. All right, so the girls have already left for Bro Sierra's uh, volleyball scrimmage. Um, obviously, before this incident happened, I had planned on going to watch the first uh, part of that, and then me and Bryce were just going to leave a little early to go to his practice, but we didn't want to leave baby alone for like you know, over four hours. So Bryce and I have been chilling here. I um, actually recorded a video for Clintus Games, so that'll be up tomorrow, the same day as this video, if you wanna check that out, about the game I've been playing and then so addicted to. Um, but what we're gonna do is, we uh, set up babe, one of baby's beds in the uh, extra room back here, and a blanket and a pillow, and just kinda like, keep her keep her secluded. You know, I, I mean, realistically, this is, she's, she's exhausted, guys. She's been sanding, she was in, hasn't been, comfortable enough to lay down. It's the first time she's laying down. I'm actually bummed that I have to ask her to get up, but I'm just gonna move it from one bed to the other, and uh, that way she's, you know, less things to worry about. If she happens to have an accident, it's on wood flooring, so less of stress. So that's what we're gonna do. I changed my mind. She's so comfy. She doesn't wanna move. I tried calling her. I tried actually grabbing the bed, moving it. She's, you know, do her typical growl. She's so comfy right now. I just, I don't even wanna move her, so. We uh, actually took the other bed, block off the stairs just in case. So really, I mean, like I said, worst case scenario, she comes over here and pukes or poops. I'm pretty confident that, that she's good, so we're gonna leave her right there. And I are, Sierra and I are back home from volleyball. I've been checking on baby through the security cameras the whole time we were gone, and I don't think she's moved. And she has not moved. She's so tired. How's it going, babies? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna lay here. I'll wag my tail. Are you thirsty? Are you okay? Good, babies. You want some water? So she seems to be doing good. She came out of her bed. I gave her both of her medications, kind of hid it in some food, and that was easy peasy. And now she's eating her basically second meal of the day that we fed her. So she's doing good. Good job, babies. I think I'm starving. Somebody is definitely back to normal. She's begging for our human food. It's just a, we're on different schedules today, so it's just whatever's in the freezer kind of a night. Snacking on some apples and baby was right here. She's like, you gonna drop another chicken wing? I'm ready for another chicken wing. My belly's better. <laughs> you already ate your food, silly girl. Yeah. Was it good? Uh -huh. 
Good try, right? Good try, good try. Well guys, I'm back home and Tiffany and the kids are all upstairs in bed. I'm gonna go ahead and edit this vlog and call it a night because I have a flight in the morning to catch to pack south. If you guys remember, um, I've gone the last two years. It's in San Antonio, Texas. It's, uh, it used to be a two-day conference. Now it's a three-day conference. It's gotten bigger. I'm um, really excited. Gonna be meeting up with a lot of my friends. Gonna be meeting a lot of uh, community members from Twitch for the first time. Um, it's gonna be a big party. I'm excited about it. However, Twitch, Twitch is not actually gonna be there. Like, there's no party, there's no pan, uh, uh, booth. So kind of bummed about that. But, um, you know, my manager's gonna be there and a few others from the actual, from actual Twitch and the community. So I'm excited about that. Um, plus all kinds of cool video games, um, all kinds of stuff, just all kinds of stuff. Um, so stay tuned, the vlogs will be very cool. You know, we get that little dual action of Tiffany vlogging here with the kids, me vlogging there with my buddies. And uh, I do a nice split. So the vlog should be a little longer here in the next couple of days, um, usually. Uh, Bryce has a basketball tournament in Chandler, uh, Mesa, Gilbert, something like that, east side. Um, so you'll get some basketball footage on from Tiffany and them, updates on baby, and uh, stuff in the packs with me. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Vlog on. Oh, and real quick, I just want to thank you all again. Thank you, thank you, thank you for all the kind words all the well wishes, all the prayers, all the positive thoughts with baby the last couple of days. Um, it's so heartwarming to see um, all of your guys' like, connection with our dog. Even though she doesn't make it in every vlog, um, she's been with us now for you know five years, since the first year of the daily vlogs, she's been with us. And so if you've been with us for one year, two years, three years, four years, five years, or even just, you know, five months. Um, she's part of the family and uh, the kids really love her. Sierra, especially, it's like her buddy. And so it really means a lot for you guys to, to say that and leave the time, take the time to leave those comments. So thank you very much, we appreciate it. And um, she's on the road to recovery and we'll keep you guys posted. Thanks. Mm -hmm.